Christian from Magaya and today I'll be sharing some tips on how to use our software better. Let's get started. To your customers, LiveTrack interface can seem a little confusing at first with too much info. I'll show you how to simplify it. First, you need to set up an admin user. That is done in your Magaya Explorer under any entity list that contains LiveTrack users. So I'm going to forwarding agents, LiveTrack user list, and clicking add here. Now the key to make this an admin user of your LiveTrack is picking your company from the dropdown. That's usually the company under file my company info. I'll create a username and password, set up all the access for this user, And to verify that I've picked the right company, just compare the system ID with your network ID on the bottom right. That's how LiveTrack will know that this user represents your company administrator, not a customer of yours, for example. So next, let's log into LiveTrack as the admin user we just created and save some views. I'll start by going to shipments and creating a view for all my in-transit cargo here. And when I go to save it, there are two additional checkboxes since I'm admin now to publish this to all LiveTrack users and even to make it their default view for shipments. All right, so let's create another one. For example, let's do open invoices, a very useful view, I'm sure, for all your customers, okay? Let's configure the columns a little bit as well to make it look more simple. Right? And save the view. Now let's see how it works by logging in as my customer John whom I've given access to view his shipments and invoices. And as you can see, the in-transit view comes up as his default, and the views are really cleaner and simpler looking than the default views. And John might like that because he's not a Magaya user and he doesn't want to go through the process of, of setting everything up himself. As a final note, the users can set their landing page as well if they go to settings and pick their default entry. So here John is an operations guy and he would like to see his shipments first when he logs in. So I'm going to set that up for him. And next time John logs in, he will be taken to his shipment screen which will show in transit shipments first because of my default setup. So as you can see now John is taken automatically to the shipment screen because that's his landing page. That's it for this time. Check out our other videos as well. Thank you.